Hey everyone, so in this video I'll be sharing simplest process for making soap by using only 4 ingredients and by using this method you can make a soap at your home. So before starting this method, let me give you a brief introduction about a soap. Now I don't think I need to define what exactly soaps are, but in terms of chemistry soaps are classified as a salt of fatty acids because of the presence of an ionic or polar head and a non-polar glyceride tail. The head is composed of positively charged sodium ion and negatively charged oxygen ion while the tail is a fatty chain. So I'm using cold process for making the soap and uh, in this process ingredients are not heated which allows them to conserve their beneficial and natural properties and uh, this is also called as a saponification reaction. Currently in market different types of soaps are available and they carry so many additives but I am not going to add any additives like scents or colorants so we can call it as a kind of base soap and uh, this is the simplest and oldest process for making the soap. So let's start with the experimental part. Now before starting this process don't forget to take these precautions. Avoid direct contact of chemicals with the skin or eyes, so wear a proper gloves and safety glasses during whole experiment. Also we are going to use caustic soda in this process and it releases coughing fumes when dissolved in water. So don't forget to wear a proper mask and keep all the chemicals out of reach of children and pets. Now let's start with the things we required before starting this process. So I am going to use 200 ml of distilled water, 80 grams caustic soda or lye, 100 grams coconut oil and 500 grams olive oil or castor oil. And you can convert this grams of oil into milliliter by dividing weight in gram with the density of that particular oil. So I am starting this process with the preparation of lye solution and this is the 200 ml of distilled water. And this is the 80 grams of lye or caustic soda. And don't forget to wear a mask because caustic soda releases cupping fumes which is not good for our health. Now add caustic soda slowly into distilled water which continuously stirring and this reaction is exothermic in nature so temperature of solution as well as mixture will increase so be gentle with this reaction. After this mixing, keep the solution aside and let it be cool up to 40 to 45 degrees centigrade temperature. Then take 500 grams of olive oil or castor oil. And 100 grams of coconut oil and mix them together. Now next step is pouring of lye solution into this mixture of oils. And if you are using castor oil then be aware while you are mixing lye solution with this oils because it carries long fatty chains than the olive oil so it will react faster and because of that long fatty chains it started harden faster than the olive oil. And you don't need to use any blender by just manually stirring your reaction will be completed. And when it converts into a suspension then directly pour into a mold otherwise your soap will start it harden into that container so keep it faster. And if you are using olive oil then use blender for mixing these solutions because it carries short fatty chains so manually it will take time. After that when it converted into a suspension and if you would like to add any additives then you can edit of your choice and then just pour this suspension into mold of your choice. This reaction is called as a saponification reaction in which ester bond and triglycerides of both the oils are being hydrolyzed and forming salted fatty acid and glycerol. Let it be set for 12 to 15 hours and after that your soap will look something like this. Now you can't use this soap directly because it will take time for curing. Currently this soap is not cured and it is soft so you have to give it minimum 4 weeks to be cured and after that you can use this soap. Now it's time for testing our soap. So that's all for this video and I'll continue with this soap making series with different types of organic soaps. So if you are new to this channel then please don't forget to subscribe, like and share. Thank you.